Peace family, I've been getting a lot of questions about my little rat tail here and I figured while I have my hair up in a style, I would come in and share a little bit about this thing here. So if you're curious how to create a rat tail with locks or what it, what it, what is it? What is it? What is it? Uh, stay tuned. So a few weeks ago, probably months ago now, um, I, let me backtrack. When I first started this set of locks, I had an undercuts for my previous set of locks. And I knew I didn't want the undercut with this set, so I had to let it grow out, which is a whole nother situation. Anyway, as it grew out, and because I have diamond parts, which converge like a diamond, um, there was like a tuft of hair in the back of my head, um, right, right, in the, right here in the back of my head. And for, like the life of this set of locks. I would just kind of shave that tough, sometimes let it grow, sometimes twist it. And one day my husband was like, you should just start a rat tail. And I was just like, ah. And so I've done it a couple times, actually like doing the instant lock technique and like locking it. And he's like, no, not a locked rat tail. Cause then you just have all locks, like something cooler than that. He's always pushing me to be better. And I appreciate that about him. So one day I was just like, oh, I want to do um, like it's like GIMP, like back in the day that we used to do when we were kids. I was like, I want to do that on that section of my hair. And so I got some hemp string, which I used to like wrap the yarn around my hair. And in all honesty, my husband helped me do this. Um, but we did this just pattern. I want to say this is like the spiral staircase down. Um, I wanted it to be kind of like my gauge for where I ideally want my locks to be, maybe. And so we did it really long. It took hours, but we got it done. Um, and the hair that's there is only like that much hair. So the majority of the rat tail is actually the yarn. It's filled with the yarn or the hemp string inside. I wash it. I've colored my hair with it. Um, when I do two strand twists or any type of styles, it does hold the shape. So like my locks are all curly. This will actually be curly too. And I just, it's like one of those adorning things. And like I have a style up right now and this rat tail can hang out. I can kind of like play with it and stuff. So I really, I really enjoy it. It's just another way to adorn your locks and, you know, have something fun be done with it. I also wanted to add that I've had this again for like a couple months now and when I first got it done, mind you, I'm very, very tender headed. It was very painful because one of those, you know, part to lock ratio things, the length of this and the string on that small portion of hair that's like back here, oh, it hurts so bad. And so what I did to remedy or alleviate the pain that I was experiencing, I actually interlocked um, the base of my tough rat tail. I interlocked the base of my rat tail. Um, interlocking is a technique that adds strength and integrity. And so as soon as I interlocked it, it felt much better. And you know, it's just fun. So that's the story of the rat tail, why I have it. Um, it's not locked, but it is a part of my like lock experience. So I really appreciate you guys for noticing, asking questions. Um, if you would like a tutorial about like how to create it, leave me a comment, let me know. And uh, I'll whip one up for you, you know I got you. So as always, I'm wishing you peace and love and good luck.